folks. Have you ever wondered what if your imagination can be turned into reality? It would be fascinating, right? A 3D printer will make this happen for you. This is Novation Academy and we will give you an overview of this magical machine called 3D printer today. A 3D printer is a computer-aided manufacturing device that creates three-dimensional objects. The 3D printer receives digital data from a computer as input. However, instead of printing the output on paper, a 3D printer builds a three-dimensional model out of a custom material. Now, 3D printers can be used by all, and it doesn't need any previous machine operating experience to get you started with this. Using these printers, we are certain that it would take your skills and your design thinking to the next level. Let me now introduce you to the hardware parts of a 3D printer. There is a printer body, heat sink, a heater sensor, a stepper motor, cooling fan, LCD display with smart controller, filament extruder, connection wires, heating bed, and a filament. Are you now ready to take a look at the inbuilt parts of a 3D printer? Well, here it is. This is the power supply switch. This is the rotary button. This rotary button works by clicking on it and it moves clockwise and anti-clockwise, both sides. This is the LCD screen. Let me talk more about the LCD screen. When you see this LCD screen, it shows you some options. Let's have a look at these options. One is the nozzle. The temperature which shows here is 200 degrees Celsius. Heating bed temperature, 50 degrees Celsius. The length, represented as X, breadth as Y, and the height as Z of the printing objects. FR means the flow rate of printing objects, which is 100%. The SD card percentage, print time of the object and the last option that you see is the SD card whether it is inserted or not. There is also a toolkit box which contains glue, power cord, filament holder, clips, fuse, spatula or a scraper, tweezer, cutter, allen key, a spanner, an SD card and a nozzle. How does this 3D printer work? 3D printer works by extruding the molten filament through a tiny nozzle that it moves in X, Y or Z axis. The printer creates a 3D model in a few hours by turning a three-dimensional CAD drawing into lots of two-dimensional cross-sectional layers. Then this 3D model is converted into G-code using the slicer software. This software slices the 3D model layer by layer and converts it into the machine language which is called G-code. This G-code is then uploaded into 3D printer to print a 3D model. Let's have a look at the process of printing a 3D object. So, are you ready to step into the design world where imagination meets reality? Let's have a look at how to operate the 3D printer machine. Let's begin with the first step. How do you give the power connection to a 3D printer? Open the 3D printer toolbox. Take out the power cord and filament holder. Give power supply to the 3D printer using this power cord and switch on the 3D printer. Let's find out how to place bed before preheating of 3D printer. Put the fevicol on the glass bed. Spread the glue all over the glass through a spatula. Take out the clips from the toolbox. Place the glass over the heated bed of the 3D printer. And finally, clip the bed of the 3D printer. Whenever you are using the 3D printer, please note that you need to make sure that the 3D printer should have been preheated at 200 degrees Celsius. And how do you preheat the printer? Simple. 
Press the rotary button to switch on. Click on the prepare option. Go to the preheat PLA. PLA stands for polylactic acid. Click on preheat PLA. Wait till the nozzle temperature reaches 200 degrees Celsius for PLA. And it's done. How do you insert PLA in 3D printer? Connect the filament holder to 3D printer. Hang the PLA on filament holder. Now press the extruder into downwards direction and pass the PLA from the two holes while pressing the extruder. Now the PLA will pass through the pipe and you need to press the nozzle of the 3D printer again in downward direction. Now your nozzle has heated to 200 degrees Celsius so easily the PLA will come out from the nozzle. So now your 3D printer is ready to print any object. Okay, how to insert an SD card in the 3D printer? Insert the SD card in the given SD card slot. When you insert this card there, it shows on the LCD screen whether the card has been inserted or not. How do you give it the command to print? SD card is already inserted in your 3D printer. Go to the print from SD card and give the print command. Here I am showing you that I am giving the print command to a twisted heart WAS model for the printing. And now your 3D printer is ready to print this WAS model. Here you can see your 3D printer is printing the first layer of the model. Interesting, right? You can do this too. Talking about the uses of the 3D printer, there are many industries which use the printing machines. And which all are there that use the 3D printer? There is the food industry, the bioprinting industry, the medical industry, they print medical devices, the industrial art and jewelry, the automotive industry, computers and robots and other ICT things, and education and research also use 3D printers. Apart from that, the 3D printers help you print 3D selfies and they help in rapid manufacturing and mass production. They also help in prototyping. Why do we use a 3D printer? For designing a prototype of any model, for printing solid objects, toys or useful things, you could even use to print the parts of a body and even students in universities and colleges can use these like chemistry students can print out 3D model of molecules and medical students can help print out human body parts using this printer. And why should we choose only a 3D printer for these things? Because it has a flexible design. It prints on demand. The parts of the 3D printer are strong and lightweight. The design is fast and production is quite fast. It minimizes waste. It definitely is cost effective. And it gives an ease of access to anyone who's using it. We hope you enjoyed understanding what all a 3D printer can help you do. Write to us for more information on this. Thank you.